So, except for our government research project, there's a shortfall for this quarter. Starting today, expense account lunches are limited to one entree and a single alcoholic beverage. Oh, uh, three months. <laughs> <laughs> Johnson, good God, man. If you've got something to say, just say it. Everyone quiet! Pitch down! Allow me to introduce ourselves. We are Pterodax, a name given us affectionately, with a nod to our winged dinosaur friends. We fly, we've got tough hides, and we will snap your heads off if you make any trouble. Alexi, Postoy, Pastorazi, Snarozi, Boris, Stenio. I'm missing all the good stuff. Right there. Oh my god, get a room. <laughs> <laughs> Peter, stand still. Is this legal? <laughs> Depends on how far they go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, would you look at the time? I better get to class. You don't have another class today. Well, then I'll find one. I'm trying to be more like you, Pete. Hey, the Binox. Keep them. There's plenty more where those came from. I think Harry thinks maybe we have things to talk about. I, uh, 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 these binocs are pretty, uh, fly. Peter, I worry about you. Right, well, I, I know you'd like me to say more, but the thing is, sometimes words just aren't enough. Really? Really. Well, what would you say if you did have the words? Okay, let's see. I'd say... Holy crap! Uh, I gotta go. Where? Chem lab. You know, it moved across campus. Gotta run. The safe is only for sample items to display at board meetings. Samples, indeed. This safe contains your company's prototype hyper diamonds, the kind that will power your government's new X ray lasers. Rismotri Zanimi. When I auction these off to my many clients around the globe, the U.S. Missile Defense Shield will have to be retooled, and I will be quite wealthy. Okay, first thing I'd spend it on, better outfits. That matching boy band look is so yesterday. Whoa. Good call. I really love what you've done with the room. It'll look even better without you. Like being a hero, go for it. She was supposed to open the safe. We still have time to laser it. Not before Spider Man and the whole New York SWAT team arrive, you idiot. This isn't over. <sighs> Amazing. Actually, I, I just happened to be in the next building over. It was more luck, really. A whole conference table goes out the window and doesn't hit anyone. What are the chances? Like you said, uh, amazing. Damn straight. Do you have any of the show Spider-Man cracking the safe? No, Spider-Man, he didn't crack the safe. Those robbers were going to. He chased them away. Spider-Man hires robbers to crack safe, then chases them away. 
That makes these photos worth $40. Great. Times six is two forty. dollars And Bolivian pesetas, maybe. And Los Estados Unidos is still 40 bucks for all six. Take it or leave it. Come on, come on, I'm a busy man. As you can see from this video, Empire One's Man in the Street Cam showing a traffic snarl at Columbus Circle. And in other news... Huh. 50. And you have exclusive rights to all still photos I took of that crime scene. You're tough, kid. 4120 and not a penny higher. Well, go, shoot. If you're gonna send me to the poorhouse, at least don't gloat about it. This is professional quality video, very slick. Then you'll buy it? No way. A man in the street cam is strictly amateur hour. That's the charm of it. Uh, but could you bring that over here? No, I need it now. Just if you could get the clean up. Put the orbs back in. You never saw anyone rehearse for the camera? You don't have a camera. Well, I will have. I'm the new lifestyle reporter. Perhaps you've seen me. Um, actually... Andy! I need that Midtown shooting tape stat. My latte can wait. Wow, it must be urgent. Uh, I'm just checking your ratings. Oh. Okay, I'm only a researcher. For now, um, I did do a piece on bosses who make their flunkies' lives a living hell, but it didn't air. I bet it was good. Indeed. I don't suppose that's the Midtown shooting tape. Even better. You should get a look at this. <gasps> Hi, I'm Peter Parker. Indira Daimanji. Everyone just calls me Indy. Indy, where are you? You were watching exclusive Empire One video of yesterday's daring 30th floor robbery attempt. Dude, let me get this straight. You charmed Indy the researcher, and she got her producer to buy your video clips? Well, she thinks I saved her life. Well, how'd you do that? Hypnosis? A fluke. Anyway, I thought I should thank her. Custom CD. You woo master, you. Just, you know, a little thank you. A card says thank you. Cappuccino for two, thank you. But a custom CD. Too much? Weapon of mass destruction. What would MJ say? Hopefully, how proud she is of my growing photography career. Oh, yeah. That could happen. Peter, I feel like a skater gliding toward you. Free and alive and excited. But then you keep veering to the side, and I always end up headed right for a big freaking crack in the ice. Hi there. You might not have noticed, but I'm a little confused about us. Peter, the word I'm looking for is consistency. I think you know how much you mean to me. Well, you better know, seeing as how... Hmm. Let's see. Oh, yeah. I told you. MJ. Peter. Uh, hi. Peter, the word I'm looking for... What's that? CD. CD with ribbon. A uh, gift. Really? For me? Well, who is it for? A uh, researcher at Empire One TV. This researcher just kind of helped me sell some news video. Oh, that's nice. What's his name? It's a she. It? She sounds lovely. Look, um, the thing is... Do you want to go to a movie with me tonight? You know, I was going to suggest the same thing, because... because... that would be terrific. Good. We'll meet at the Drip Den. Seven o'clock. Yeah. Um, I've got to go. Empire One. <laughs> there it is. The Empire One newsroom. I still don't see what this gets us. Look a little harder. They put us on the news, now we will pay the favor. Gentlemen, energize your weapons. Parker, up-and-coming news photog. What's this? A whole disc of news videos? What do you do? Just stalk the police? Or No. You perpetrate the crimes. That's how you're always there. I saw that in a movie once, but... Nah, you've got too kind of face. I can read faces. Excuse me. It's not news, actually. It's just a little thank you. Oh, 
Oh, I do things for people all the time and they never... Thanks. My stuff only got onto the evening news because you helped out. Well, I would have been news on the evening news if not for you. Young indentured servant meets tragic death doing what she loves best. Pretending to report. You're gonna do it. I have a good feeling. Yeah. Hey, wait a minute. Are you like a precog or something? <laughs> Sometimes. What? Employees of Empire One, for those of you who missed your own station's news coverage, we are Pterodax. Kindly put all cell phones into the receptacle my heavily armed colleague is passing around. Don't give him a hard time. He will kill you. So, you and Peter, you don't keep secrets from each other, do you? We're guys. It's not in our chemistry. I could tell you that without ever having stepped foot in a chem lab. Okay, then tell me what's going on in that big brain of his. Oh, no. I know where this is going. Really? And where's that? Want to turn me into one of your chick friends. Chick friends? You heard me. I'd like to think I didn't. Today you want to confide in me about Peter. Tomorrow you'll have me along shoe shopping. Okay, what do you want to know? Actually, I think you just explained everything. Listening is not your end of the species' best skill. Guilty as charged. Whatever it is you said. The problem is simple. Peter wasn't listening. He hasn't heard a word. I'll just have to talk very slowly to you both from now on. We got everyone out of the building except for the top floor. The Empire One news staff. Swap team's on its way. Alexi, Prevred, Grishu. Attention, please. Are there any cameramen about? I can run a camera. You can? Of course. Just tell me where the on switch is. Little button in back, bottom left. Well, you're certainly no threat. You'll do fine. Tell them what business we mean. You, stop the camera. To all of you federal agents running face recognition programs, let me save you some time. We are former KGB agents who have been blessed with the creme de la creme of Soviet-era experimental hardware. Like these. X-11 concussion bombs. The sonic waves liquefy human organs while doing minimal damage to valuable real estate. Five these will be placed discreetly around this room. We have one simple demand. We want Spider-Man here, in the flesh, before the 8 p.m. news. He has exactly one hour and 24 minutes to show his masked face, or everyone here dies. my communicator who took my communicator huh you i feel someone right now if i don't get my communicator back you what are you looking at someone with no self-control we're all just sitting here no one took your stupid communicator okay leave her alone you want spider-man right if you hurt anyone here he's gonna come in gunning for you you know that. Mr. Busybody, maybe you saw who took my communicator. No? I show everyone what happens. I... Look harder, imbecile. Sit. Fancy camera work is done. Hey, don't get it in your head that you're gonna save my life once every day, because it'll tire you out. I plan on living forever. Is it me? 
Do I have some kind of weird pheromone that shouts out to Peter Parker? Run away! Run away! MJ. I thought maybe he'd be here doing homework or something stupid like that, but I knew in my heart he just stood me up. Mary Jane, shut up for a sec. I just turned on the news. Empire One's been taken hostage. That's where Peter went. Oh, my God. The hostages have only 17 minutes left. Come on, come on. We've got to go down there. In exactly 11 minutes, we will know if your hero intends to save you. In preparation, kindly lie face down, with eyes closed. Do it! You're supposed to meet your future mate in the workplace. They never say anything about dying there with them. Oh, I can't believe I just said that. If we get out of this, I'm gonna be really embarrassed. So you'll do a lifestyle piece. Hostage's most embarrassing moments when you're a reporter. Look, I might have to try something. So if I'm not here... Eyes closed, now! We've got everything evacuated in a five block radius. Friendly Neighborhood Spider-Man at your service. Huh. Where are they? They got me here. It's a setup. They're already gone. I need everyone on their feet, now. Listen carefully. Get these people to the other side of the building and call for help. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. By the way, you might come across a Peter Parker over on the other side. I ran into him earlier. Oh, what a relief. Did he mention me? Go! Five bombs. Where are they? Just as you planned. Glorious. Spider-Man is dead. New York City's finest are otherwise engaged. And the diamonds... ...are finally ours. Alexi. Alexi, come in, Alexi. Um, uh, Alexi can't come to the phone right now. Can I say who's calling? He's tied uh. up at the moment. <laughs> but I'll be taking his place in a sec. <sighs> Diamonds, girl's best friend. Glad you dropped in. We're gonna have a blast. Five seconds to recharge. Better make your next shot count. Okay. Uh, that's not the last one. That can't be the last one. I'm sure he, he probably... Look, there he is. You go ahead. I'll catch up in a sec. Peter! I was worried about you. 
I was searching for a way out. Good thing Spider-Man showed up when he did. Okay, so listen, that stuff I said to you? Uh, not to worry. It was a tense situation. I know that. I said I'd be embarrassed, but you see, I'm not. <clears throat> Peter? <gasps>